Good evening, everyone, and welcome to SWE Heatwave. This is going to be our first match suggested by Omega Project. We have got a tag team tables match for the number one contender for the SWE Tag Team Championships. We have got Wild Thing, the team of Eddie Kingston and John Moxley, going up against the Dudley Boys. Let's crack a lock into the action. All right, let's go. Right, this should be interesting. Uh, tables match. We've not done one of these in a while, uh, especially in the tag team division, so I'm interested to see how this one's going to go. Hopefully it'll be fun. Uh, where are we? I'm just uh, trying to get into the ranking system so we can double check all this stuff. Right, so I think uh, Moxley was doing okay last time I looked, wasn't he? Uh, he's on a plus four. He's leveled out for the year now. Eight matches on a zero, so he's not really done much this year. Uh, Eddie Kingston, he's on a minus two for the year, so he's not doing... Uh, he's on a minus two overall, shall I say. And in terms of the Dudleys, uh, Devon Dudley is on a plus one. Um, and Bubba Ray is on a plus zero. And of course, the next couple of weeks are going to be an ECW-themed set of shows. Uh, lots of uh, ECW names, as well as some others as well. I mean, we're not just sticking solidly to ECW. A spinning kick there in the face by Bubba Ray. And at the moment, uh, well, it's pretty even at the moment. You see Eddie Kingston in control of Devon on the other side. Bubba Ray working over Moxley. Moxley now takes Bubba into the DDT. That classic ECW heatwave arena. How cool is that? How cool is the classic ECW arena? And of course, I mean, it's mad because I planned this when there was... I mean, it's still pretty damn hot in the UK. I know uh, it's very, very hot in America, isn't it, at the moment? So uh, you're getting more of the heat wave than we are. As Bubba has the table. Uh, can't quite get it into the ring. Uh, Mox is going to try the other table. He's going to throw that on the floor as well. Okay, so it looks like AI-wise, uh, they're still incredibly stupid. Um, that does look like the situation. Tables falling all over the place. Nobody seems to be able to get the table in the ring. That's the problem. Devon now stamping on the back of the knees. And Bubba went for like a springboard forearm. I'm not quite sure who's done this moveset for the ECW Bubba and uh, Devon. But I must admit, it doesn't seem right. <laughs> I mean, springboards and all that sort of stuff is just not what I expect when I think of the Dudley Boys, to be honest. As Moxley. Well done, Moxley. Well done. What a hero. Figured out how to get the table inside the ring and then gets completely clotheslined out of his socks in the process. So we do have two tables in the ring now and Bubba is looking for a third. Mox is now going to set one of the tables up in the middle of the ring. We've got tables galore knocking around inside the ring now. Bubba slides out the way. Is he going to get another table? Nope, he's changed his mind. Okay. I think, Bubba, we have enough tables, I think, to be honest with you. I think any more tables would be an overkill. Mox launches Bubba across the ring via the neck. Very painful looking manoeuvre. Now Mox wrenching back at the arm. Eddie Kingston re-enters the ring. Bubba with that boot right in the face of Moxley. But Mox has caught him again. And that snap suplex very close to the table. A little bit too far away though. As now Moxley looking to work over the arm. Remember, the winner of this one will be the first team to challenge Evolution for the SWE Tag Team Championships after they defeated the uh, the former champions, House of Black, a few days ago. Mox just launching Bubba over the top. Devon still on the outside, clashing with Eddie Kingston. Devon slides now into the ring and slides back out the ring. Nice little back and forth there. And now all four men on the outside. As you can see, no matting around here. This is pure concrete. This is how you get yourself hurt. Normally we have a, a thin matting around the outside just to take the edge off, just to protect you from being busted open, really. But that is not what we have in this situation.
Nice half and half suplex on the outside by Kingston there on Devon Dudley. That was brutal. A strikes in the face there by Eddie Kingston. And now Bubba looking to take Mox up. And there's the over-the-top spine first onto the concrete as Eddie Kingston has the Boston Crab locked in on Devon. Moxley now sending Bubba back into the ring. And Devon and Bubba both in the ring now. Eddie Kingston needs to get in and help his teammate. And Kingston tries to get a hold of Devon. Bubba now with a boot in the gut. And again, there's some random maneuver. I don't know who's done... I might be completely wrong here. But for me, this, this Bubba Ray's moveset just does not seem correct to me at all. The core's pretty good, but the moveset just seems a little bit out there to me. But I, I might be wrong. I might just be misremembering how it was back in the day. That's jabs in the face. And Bubba with a strike again. And Bubba now is in full control. He has Eddie Kingston where he wants him, really. Oh, I thought he was going to try and drop him through the table then. But no, went for the knee in the face from the suplex position. Another big knee in the face, spinning back fist, the Hurricane, which is one of um, Eddie's own finishing maneuvers. And I think he was looking for the Bubba Cutter, completely uh, went off on one there. I think he completely got a bit lost, really. Kingston fighting back. Bubba had him lined up against that table, ready to go. Kingston now sending Bubba, crashing gut first into the table. And Eddie Kingston now... In with that German suplex and sending Bubba Ray Dudley straight through the table. And there's the victory for Wild Thing. Victory then for the team of Eddie Kingston and John Moxley. The Dudley boys drop down a point in the ranking system. Moxley moves up to a plus five in the system. Eddie Kingston is going to move up to a minus one. Then in the tag team division, Wild Thing in the first tag team match of the year move up to a plus two, whereas the Dudley boys are going to move down to a plus five. So they're already pretty high, the Dudley boys. Um, and plus five doesn't really move them anywhere. They're still uh, right in the top five in the rankings as well. But there we go. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Uh, if you have, hit the like, subscribe, all the other good stuff. And I will see you all again very soon. And later on today, we will have a Elimination Chamber to crown the number one contender for the SWE Championship. So make sure to check that one out as well. Good night.